Welcome to Once Upon a Pipe, my post-Thanksgiving dinner relaxing moment by the fireplace. Fire's not going too good <laughs> right now. Really didn't have any firewood. I just had uh, one log left over. Didn't even think about the fireplace in the midst of all the other chaos going on. have my Lord of the Rings pipe and uh, tonight I am capping off the evening with Hearth and Homes 10 to midnight which this for me is a five star blend it is um, probably the best um, blend that I've had um, just phenomenal. Well, I've um, had an opportunity here and there um, to catch a couple of uh, posts that I've seen uh, on Thanksgiving. I got to see Holy Smoking Pipe Padres post and uh, Smoking Grandpa Bones down in Florida. At least that's where he's filming from, and um, a couple others. Um, I'm glad that, um, for the most part, it's it's been a very peaceful Thanksgiving. A lot to be thankful for. Um, this time of year, is um, I think for me more melancholy time. Just different events that happen. Weather also kind of plays a part in that. And actually I, I really enjoy and I really like cold gray rainy days um, makes me feel at home but uh, some of the things I think about in particular this Thanksgiving it falls uh, close to my mother's birthday my mother passed away in 2010 um, it's just kind of hard to believe it's been that long ago but um, her birthday was November 22nd she would have been 80 years old this year if she was still with us. Um, also, I just, um, I think about those times when uh, I was away from family, when I was away from my mom and my dad, uh, when I was a young soldier stationed out in Fort Carson, Colorado in the late 80s. Um, how incredibly lonely that time was uh, this time of year um, just a, a whole, whole different world but very very thankful that uh, today I'm close to family um, I only live a couple miles from my dad. We really enjoyed having him over. My wife bought two turkeys and he prepared them and brought them over for us to eat along with some greens with ham and some um, gravy uh, and some deviled eggs. And it was all excellent. My wife prepared a couple dishes, including an apple pie and an apple crisp. Um, very, very, very good meal. Um, she invited a friend and her family over, our kids, so that ended up, it was, it was good. Very good, very peaceful meal. So I'm glad from what I've seen thus far that um, most people have had a very peaceful, very nice Thanksgiving.
And just to get some fresh air, I did take one quick spin um, to Walmart. I just drove around the perimeter of that parking lot. Uh, it was packed, absolutely packed. And as I uh, observed all of the going on, um, I was very thankful I was not part of that chaos. You know, um, all of the Black Friday stuff and the marketing, all of the newspaper ads, the dozens of emails and all of that stuff. Um, it's just not for me. I know there's some super deals out there, but uh, I would much rather withdraw to some peace and quiet. So, um, as I watched the people hustling in and just seeing the parking lot, I could not imagine what it was like inside the store, but I was very thankful not to be there. Um, just thankful to be here at home uh, with my family um, and enjoying something that's far more simpler, just a good old pipe, some good tobacco, and some good company. For those of you who dare to brave Black Friday, I, I wish you well. I hope you have a great weekend and uh, pray that God will continue to bless us throughout uh, the remaining part of this year and into the Christmas season as we can now start preparing our hearts and our minds for what that um, for what that season means. Um, and I know that there are several who, who don't believe as I do uh, in what Christmas is about, but um, It still doesn't, still doesn't change the meaning. So, I wish everyone well. Thank you for tuning in to Once Upon a Pipe. And I look forward to seeing you on the next go-around.